Good Tuesday evening, everybody. Come on in. It's time to get one of those quicker than quick meals going. We're going back to college days now. All this can be done right in the microwave since I have been out all afternoon and it is now 7 o'clock and I'm not about to start cooking from scratch. So I grabbed a rotisserie chicken from Sam's. I already had some corn in the uh, cabinet and I bought some uh, fresh broccoli. So we're gonna have some rotisserie chicken, some steamed uh, seasoned fresh broccoli, and some corn. This is one of Corrine's favorites, so we're gonna feast on this this afternoon. This is so simple to fix. 15 minutes, we can have this on the table. And like I say, this is how appropriate since kids are going back to school. So college students, if you don't have a lot of money, which most of y'all, don't i know uh most of the college kids i knew didn't have a whole lot of money we used to uh feed a couple so my husband and i used to feed a couple and it was just one of those things that they were so excited about whenever we went to the campus and took them out to lunch so here's one of those real and this is a good meal this is not just some oodles of news we did the oodles of news the other day but this is a complete meal y'all hang on let me rinse my hands off Okay, this is chicken, broccoli, and corn, a complete meal. And look, I've even got some lettuce over there on the side, so I might even decide, well, I will decide to, uh, to eat a salad along with my meal. So here we go. Kareem and I are going to share this chicken. Let me get it. I've cut it in half. We're going to put it in my pan here. You get it over here and like so and we like to put barbecue sauce on ours i was like a drumstick so i'm gonna get me a drumstick off there so just a little over half a chicken so i put that extra drumstick on there and slide that back so you can see so i got my chicken in the pan so got the chicken ready to go so what i usually do with my breast is i just cut it sort of like this Cause I like, like eat that uh, leg and a piece of breast and Kareem will eat the rest of it. Okay, I've got a can of whole kernel corn. I put some butter, a little brown sugar, and some black pepper in it. And we're gonna put some saran wrap on it. It's gonna go into the microwave for about 10 minutes. And it'll be the, one of the best flakes of dishes of corn that you have. Okay, the broccoli, what I'm gonna do with it, I've got Onion powder, garlic powder, complete seasoning, and some lemon pepper seasoning on there, and some black pepper. I'm gonna pour some butter. I melted some butter, pour over it, put uh, some saran wrap on it, wrap it real tight, and, and it's gonna go into the microwave. This whole meal can go in the microwave. Of course, the chicken has to be heated. And because we love barbecue chicken, I'm just gonna, look, we're gonna be very, Delivered, directed to the point with this meal, y'all. We take no prisons. We play no games with this meal. So I've got the barbecue sauce, and we use that sweet baby race, which is already seasoned and I already already mixed. I always put a little bit of extra vinegar and a little brown sugar. So I've already done that uh, the last time I used it. Oh, you can use it straight out of the bottle. You don't have to really do anything. I just like to zhuzh mine up a little bit. And just spread that barbecue sauce all over that chicken really, really good. Everything's going to get saran wrapped. And then we're going to put it into the microwave. And when you see it again, it'll be ready for eating. So hold on. Let me just get the butter to pull that broccoli. And I'm going to pour just a little, little bit of water on there. That's all we need. We got it seasoned up really good. We got the butter on. And all I'm going to do is put this ram wrap on. Nice and snug. So, 
I hope y'all have had a God blessed Tuesday. I've been running all afternoon and I was just not in any shape to come in and start cooking. And y'all know me, I don't do the eating out thing, so. Kareem and I are eat. I stopped at uh, my Walmart too because I had to grab some um, pour a little bit of that broth off of that chicken just to keep it moist. I meant to pour some of it on my this broth off that chicken is really really good. I meant to also pour some on my broccoli. I wrapped it up before I did, but we can still do it right here. Just pull that broth right over the top of that. Extra added flavor. Y'all know we got the flavor over here. The flavor, the flavor, the flavor. And we're gonna fire this up for about a good 10 minutes. And then we'll be ready. We're gonna sit back, relax, and enjoy. We're gonna get a glass of that cold lemonade and all water. And we're gonna be ready to eat this meal here shortly. I'm telling you, on those days when you don't feel like getting in that kitchen cooking, you know, some things I just don't reinvent the wheel. When I want uh, baked chicken, I just go on to the uh, Sam's Club and get me out. They have, to me, they have the best rotisserie chicken that I've tasted. I have, I give them kudos over my rotisserie chicken. I tell you, they have some good ch chicken. I'll give credit to where credit is due. So, we're going to put this in for about 10 minutes and let it heat up. And I will be right back. Okay, y'all, there it is. Dinner is served. That barbecue chicken is, whoo, it smells so good, y'all. I wish y'all could taste it. That good old rotisserie chicken with the barbecue sauce on it, wonderful. That golden, creamy, uh, buttery corn and that garlicky um, broccoli is just ready for us to sit back, relax, and enjoy it. Now, listen. College kids, listen, this chicken, $5. Can of corn, a dollar. Uh, broccoli, half a bag of that broccoli, about two bucks. So we're talking under $10. You can put this on the table. You can, uh, uh, that rotisserie chicken will probably feed four people. Maybe a couple cans of corn, you know, if you got some company coming or something like that. You can do this meal for under $10 and have a good, healthy, hearty meal, something that tastes uh, like something you had from home. So listen, guys, all you got to do, run to the store, get your rotisserie chicken, pop a can of corn open, open that bag of fresh frozen broccoli, and you got something on your hand to eat that is going to be good. It's going to be delicious. And it really doesn't take that long to prepare it either. So listen, uh, the next time you are uh, sitting around the dorm room and want a nice gourmet meal, all you got to do, I know you all got those little uh, freezers probably in your rooms. If not, just run to the store and get it. But seriously, though, these meals like this are good for uh, a quick meal, you know, for a regular family. For, you know, if you work, you got kids, this is a great meal. And since um, I thought about college students, this is a really, really a great meal. And along with this meal goes praying. So you all guys, please continue to pray without ceasing. Being kind to someone. Um, keep your heads deep into the books, but also stay in prayer and watch how much better your academics will go. Do something kind for someone. Pray without ceasing. So guys, keep those prayers going up now so the blessing will still continue to come down. We're going to continue to pray for our, our students from kindergarten through uh, grad school. So until I decide to cook something again, y'all. I don't know what I'm going to get in here and just really, really, really cook between now and Sunday. But until I do, love you guys. Thank y'all for stopping by. Toodles.